All right, it's very important that you know thy audience. So Facebook gives you this information. Um, if you're not sure how to get this information for your Facebook page, uh, feel free to click on the uh, send message or request time book now button on my Facebook page and I'll respond to you. Um, <clears throat> for my Facebook page, I got a uh, higher percentage of women than men. The gray bar that you see behind there is typical of the audience that I, I am uh, targeting. So it tells me for the females, 35 to 54, I'm higher than average. Uh, same thing for men in that um, area. The, the blue is me specifically, my page, as compared to the rest of Facebook for my category. I'm at a work and play lifestyle and a firmly established lifestyle. Those are lifestyles. Work and play um, contains affluent single parents, uh, predominantly white collar professional metro centrics that enjoy a comfortable income and a mix of homeowners and renters versus a firmly established is households, upper middle class couples with school age children. They are homeowners, often minivan drivers and avid radio listeners. Uh, the relationship status, again, from my page is in the blue. Uh, I'm 16% above average for Facebookers in terms of my page compared to the rest of Facebook for my category. And I am, uh, as you can see, higher for uh, college and grad school. <clears throat> The job titles that primarily engage, interact with my Facebook page, uh, those job titles are as compared to the rest of Facebook. They are higher in the area of arts, entertainment, sports and media, sales, business and finance and management. That makes perfect sense to me. My page is very much about selling, using social media for the act of revenue generation, cost reduction, and improved or enhanced customer experiences. So all of this makes perfect sense to me. When you do this for your page, um, you will probably see a completely different spectrum. The most important thing, always know your audience.